But the process is the same. We are still going to push you. We are still going to try you. We are still going to stress you in order so that you can relieve us in the mess. Booyah! Booyah! One, two, three! Some say they're rugged individualists who sail their own course. Others say they're the backbone of the Navy. Probably they're both. They are the chief petty officers, the chiefs. And this is their story. Today is uh, TPO Naval Heritage Day for, for the selectees here. We had some Naval Heritage trivia. We did some marching, some chanting. Uh, we learned a lot about uh, naval heritage with regards to uh, the battleship itself. A lot of people that are here today uh, with me uh, all came from different walks of life, different uh, backgrounds, uh, but to come together to um, accomplish one goal, which is to make chief, it's a, it's a big deal and it's a, it's a time to be proud of that accomplishment. The purpose of today is to show our future chiefs some of the uh, history and heritage, where they came from, why we do some of the things we do. Um, I mean, uh, we've seen uh, origins of the uniforms to uh, the, the history of this ship, what it was like then compared to what it was like today. I think, uh, you know, with anything, you can learn a lot from history. It's important to know chief heritage because this job is unlike any other. We don't just perform actions and execute mission. This is a life choice. And heritage, our very rich heritage, is a very strong part of that. You have to be proud of what you are. You know, you can't just be a part of something and not knowing why it's there, the history of it, and why you have so much pride and so many others have pride in it. So once you know it, then you have a little bit more determination to be a part of something that's so much greater than what you are. If you don't know the past, if you're not aware of the past, you can really hardly take, face the future knowledgeably and effectively. Chief Select should be willing to try. Everybody's different. You have some that are strong and open and outgoing, but every Chief Select has to be willing to try so that they can learn new skills and so they can succeed outside of their comfort zone. You do not yet know the influence you will have as a Chief Petty Officer in the United States Navy. But I'm here to tell you that it is not only how you're going to influence the sailors that work for you. It's how you're going to influence your fellow Chiefs, how you're going to influence the officers that are appointed above you. You have a tremendous opportunity to exert leadership. What, what an achievement. I'm so proud for you. I'm proud of you. I hope you're proud of yourselves for doing this.